for many, this time of year is the perfect opportunity to take off to the North Carolina mountains and hit the slopes. And for one local veteran, the ski slopes at Beach Mountain hold a special meaning after an organization stepped in to help him rediscover his love for skiing. That amazing feeling of gliding down a mountain in the cold. You know, I fell in love with it. That's how Kevin Beck describes his love of skiing. A friend in the Navy taught him how to ski and he never looked back. But then a devastating injury. In May of 1979 on the USS Midway, a tank of fuel on an aircraft was released and it fell on my right foot, crushing it. After 30 years of surgeries, Kevin finally had to amputate his right leg below the knee and start all over again. He thought he'd never have that feeling of gliding down a mountain again. And that's where Spark came in. I came up here to Beach Mountain. The VA had said, don't you want to learn to ski again? I said, oh, I sure do. Al Kay is the Beach Mountain coordinator for Spark, which stands for Sports, Arts, and Recreation of Chattanooga a chapter of Move United. This will be the 40th year, longest actively going national skiing program event for this. First started around 1981, and Beach Mountain happened to be the first national clinic. And the lessons, all free of charge. This year, they'll be celebrating 40 years. What was that like for you when you really started getting to, to ski? to ski again? Well, first, it was quite, well, I'll use, use the word freaky, because I just really got into walking good. And here I am taking on a challenge of skiing. It's called adaptive skiing, and it's offered not only for veterans like Kevin, but anyone with physical challenges, including the visually impaired. We also work with individuals like parents who have use with various things happen like spina bifida or cerebral palsy, other neurological disorders, and they are seeking their child to be in a regular world. Kevin loved it so much, he decided to move from his childhood home of New Bern. My wife and I decided, let's buy a house on Beach Mountain and move there and retire. So we did. And every year, Kevin volunteers with Spark. The joy in the faces of each and every participant that comes down with ability levels that that they can't walk. Some of them can't communicate or talk, but boy, a smile. And you can tell it brings great joy. And with that, it fills my heart. So for all the information on the program, if you want to participate, volunteer or donate, we have all that on our website, WCNC.com. And Ben, we should note Spark is not just for snow skiing. They have water skiing, biking, whatever you name it, they have it. Wow, it's such a neat story because I mean, listen, if you, if you ski, then you know there's nothing quite like that feeling of exhilaration rushing down a mountain. And, and once you've had that once, you, you never want to give up again. So uh, great to see folks like this uh, getting out there on the slopes. Yes, amazing. I was so inspired just hearing Kevin's story for sure. It's amazing.